Hello friend, in this video, you are about to learn that how to make root bone in Blender. So let's start this tutorial. This is character from previous video. You can watch previous tutorial for better understanding. Now let's start this tutorial. First select bone, then switch to edit mode. Now press shift A and it will add bone on 3D cursor. Make sure keep your 3D cursor on world origin. You can see this bone is IK controller. So it will control this leg bone and this is also IK controller. So it will also control this leg. So select this bone first. Then holding shift, select this bone. Now press Ctrl P and select here keep offset. Now you can see this IK controller is parented with this bone. Now select this bone. Now press G. You can see that this is also separate bone. So select this. Then holding shift. Select this, now press Ctrl P and select here keep offset. Now this bone is also IK controller so it will control hand bone. So select this first, then holding shift, select this bone and press Ctrl P and select here keep offset. Now switch to pose mode. Now select this bone, now press G and you can see that this is not working well. So switch to edit mode again and this bone is not parented with this bone. So select this bone, holding shift, select this bone, now press Ctrl P and select here keep offset. Now again switch to pose mode. Select this bone, now press G and you can see that this is moving entire bone system. Now switch to object mode. Now we have to give shape for this bone. Now press shift A, under mesh, select any shape for your bone. I am selecting here circle. Now switch to edit mode, now press S for a scale. Now select vertex in this way. So select this vertex, holding shift, select this vertex, select this vertex and select this vertex. Now turn on proportional editing mode. Now press S and scale like this and use a scroll up for proportion. Now click on this modifier properties and apply here subdivision surface modifier. Now switch to object mode and apply this modifier. Now select armature, switch to pose mode. Now select this root bone, then click on this bone properties and under this viewport display, under this custom object, select circle. You can see that it has wrong rotation, so you can fix here. Change X rotation value that is 90. Now you can hide this circle. Now press G and you can see that it is moving well. And it is very useful if you want to parent this bone system with curve. For example, I am showing here press shift A under curve, select here Bezier curve. Now switch to edit mode, now press X and delete vertex, now press T for this tool properties and select here draw, then click on this active tools icon, now change tolerance value that is 50, now turn off this proportional editing mode and draw curve like this, switch to object mode. Now select this bone, 
switch to pose mode now make sure you have to select this root one then click on this bone constraint properties then click on this add bone constraint and select here follow path under this target select major curve now you can change offset value for animation also enable this follow curve option now just this is following curve if you want to flip character then switch to object mode select this curve switch to edit mode now click on the segments and select here switch direction now select this bone and just change this offset value I hope you learn something from this video leave your comments and subscribe to this channel